Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. So this week I'm doing a Zara haul. As you guys know, they are one of my favorite clothing brands. I've got so many stunning occasion dresses from them. So I'm gonna show you what those pieces look like on and talk you through the fit and everything. And then I've also got a really exciting new jewelry unboxing with PD Paula. And I know that you guys love them just as much as I do. They are such a stunning jewelry brand. So I can't wait to show you guys what I picked up. This haul is a try on haul. So I'm gonna pop clips on screen here of what all the pieces look like on. Everything is also gonna be linked down below in the description box. You can shop everything from down there. And I'll also leave my Instagram and TikTok if you wanna see how I style up my outfits on a daily basis. So first of all, I'm gonna to talk to you guys about PD Paula and I'm gonna show you the new jewelry bits that I've got from them. So if you don't know who PD Paula are, they're a Barcelona based jewelry brand and they specialize in stunning classic pieces of jewelry that are just so timeless that you can just wear year on year. And um, that's definitely something that's true for me. I've got so many pieces from them and they're such staples in my jewelry collection. And I've actually got on some other pieces from them today that I got from them previously. So I've got on some stunning little um, diamante hoops and a little diamante stud. I don't know if you can see that well, but um, they are one of my favorite jewelry brands. So I can't wait to show you the new pieces that I picked up. Um, they've also kindly given me a discount code for you guys. So for 15% off, you can use my discount code OliviaB15, all in capitals. So I'll pop it on screen here somewhere so you can see it really clearly. Um, but yeah, so definitely head over to their website, which I'll link down below so you can see what other pieces they've got as well. So the pieces that I'm showing you today are all from the new Vanilla collection. So this collection is all made from recycled sterling silver and it really focuses on timeless versatile pieces that are going to be lasting in your collection and they are also really versatile in terms of wearing them in the day or in the evening. Um, so that is really good. So the pieces come in these lovely little canvas dust bags which are so good for when you're traveling. Like I always keep these for popping in my jewelry. They're just super handy. And then they also come in these little boxes that say PD Paula on the front. And then all the individual pieces are also packaged in these little canvas pouches, which are so cute and just protect the jewelry even more. So first I'm gonna show you the new ring set that I got. So this is the Debbie stamp ring. So this is actually, um, I got this as a set so that I could wear these two rings together. So this is the Debbie stamp ring in the 18 karat gold plating. It's just a super simple gold ring. It's like a little bit chunky, but not too much. So it's really nice, like I say, for every day, or also if you wanted to go out in the evening, this stacked up with other rings will look really cute. Um, and then the, the ring also comes in silver in a slightly smaller size. So I've just put it on there as a stack and I think it looks so lovely, the gold against the silver. It looks so classic and timeless. The style of this ring as well reminds me of like a classic signet ring style, but with a twist because instead of it being um, just a round sort of design, like signet rings generally are, it's in sort of like this pear drop shape and just puts a different um, take on that sort of style ring, which is really nice. Next, I got some stunning earrings that I got in mind to wear as a ear stack. I have multiple piercings, so that is something that I love to do is to stack up lots of different earrings. So first of all, I'm gonna show you these stunning hoops that I picked up. These are the Duke hoops and these are in the yellow gold. So these at this angle look like a classic gold style hoop, but from the side, you can see they are more of a pointed um, profile on the hoop. They're just like really classic and timeless. Uh, but with a bit of a twist again, which I really like. And again, those hoops are 18 karat gold plated. And then another earring that I picked up is this stunning spice single earring. And um, this is so gorgeous. So it's this stunning clear gemstone design. And it's sort of like a stud in this teardrop shape with then another teardrop hanging down from it, which creates a little dangly earring. You can wear it sort of just as a normal stud with the with the drop hanging down, or you can twist it in different ways and create different sort of effects with the earring. But I think these catch the light so beautifully. The quality is amazing. And the stones just sparkle so much. So I cannot wait to wear these ones. And then the next earring that I picked up so this one is called the vanilla single earring. So I'll bring that one in as well so you can get a better look at it. This is this stunning pear drop shape stud 
and this one has again these clear gemstones which catch the light so nicely but what I love about this one is that the gemstones in there are a mix of shapes so you've got some round and I believe you've got some pear in there as well it just adds something a bit different to just your normal sparkly stud that you would get this one looks really special and it makes it look really expensive as well I think so this one again I got just as a single stud but you can buy it as a pair if you wanted um, but yeah these are so gorgeous and then next I got these stunning green Aventuri Nomad hoops I think I'm saying that right the Aventuri part of the name is the actual gemstone name um, so it is a natural green gemstone it's in their really nice pale green color but yes yeah, so you can see the pale green color of this is so beautiful i think that the green looks so nice against the yellow gold and also green is my favorite color to wear in the summer i think that the pale green goes so beautifully with neutrals and it's just such a flattering color i think on everyone and again these are 18 karat gold plated and then carrying on the green gemstone trend, I got a couple more earrings like that. So this again is with the same gemstone. So this one is called the Green Aventuri Ginger Single Stud. So this one again is as a single earring, but you could get it as a pair if you prefer. And this one has the gemstone on the top as a stud, and then it has a um, drop hanging from it, which is actually the same style as the um, spice earring that I showed you. So there you go, you can see that one. So that is such a stunning colour contrast of the green with the white stones underneath. It makes the green stone look really nice and bright and it also makes the white of the stones underneath really pop. So that one is so stunning. So that is definitely something I would wear probably on the lobe somewhere. Um, but yeah, really love that one. And then the last earring that I picked up is the green Aventuri single nomad earring so again this one can be purchased as a pair if you prefer um, and this one is very similar to the last one i showed you but just without the um, extra drop on the bottom just super simple little green gemstone stud and this one is going to look so nice styled up next to the other green one i think I'll probably layer those which you'll see in the cutaway but these are such stunning pieces the quality is amazing and i know i'm gonna get so much wear out of those and then lastly from pd paula i got a stunning bracelet so this is the new sky rope and chain bracelet so this is a new collection of bracelets that have come out that are this stunning chain with a rope design woven within the chain and then it's also fastened with a toggle clasp that just pulls tight which is so handy so that is the bracelet there. So you can see the colour contrast with the pale blue and white with the yellow gold. It's super stunning. So that is everything that I picked up from PD Paula. So I hope you guys loved all the jewellery bits that I picked up. I absolutely do and I cannot wait to get some wear out of them. There is so much more on the website and not just on the website in general but just this vanilla collection. There's so much that I haven't been able to show you so be sure to head over and check out the rest of the collection and use my discount code which I'll pop on screen again now which is OliviaB15 all in capitals. You can get 15% off if you want to go ahead and purchase any of the bits that I've shown you today or any other pieces from their website. And now I'm gonna show you the pieces that I picked up from Zara. So I got so many stunning bits from Zara. I'm loving their stuff at the minute. Also, I forgot to say at the start of the video, for size reference, I'm a UK size six and I'm five foot seven. Um, but first thing I'm gonna show you is this stunning crochet dress. This was a bit of a disappointment for me, but I'll explain why in a second. But this is this stunning mid-axis length crochet dress. It's in like a um, high neck style here and ties around the neck and then this is um, figure hugging as well and then just glides down from the hips and it is so beautiful. It fits really well for me except for the underlining of the dress is too short and it sits sort of in the middle of my bum so this is definitely not something I'm going to be able to keep unfortunately so if you're my height or taller this dress is unfortunately not going to work for you um, but if you're shorter than me, then I would definitely say to give this a go. It's really flattering and um, other than the, the height issue, the sizing was fine. I got this in the smallest size that they did this dress in, which is a small, and um, it is $49.99. Um, next, I got this dress from Zara. So this I actually saw in the store in Trafford Centre on a mannequin and I thought it looked so stunning. It's not the sort of pattern I would usually go for. It's, a, it's like quite a large floral, which I don't usually like gravitate towards. But what drew me to this dress is the bottom detail. It's this stunning sort of ruched um, organza material, like mesh, meshy organza 
and um, it's got all these ruffles as well and I just thought the bottom of it is so flattering I just had to try it and it did not disappoint it fits really well and I really love the style of it it's a bandeau neckline as well which is one of my absolute favorites and this one again it comes small medium large and I got it in the small and this one is only 29.99 so I do think it's a bargain um, but yeah, I, I would definitely recommend this one. I absolutely love this dress. Next, this dress I think will be so stunning if you have a wedding coming up. So this is actually a very, very similar style dress to one that I wore to my friend's wedding from Another Stories. It's a very similar neckline and shape, but it's in this stunning sage green color. This would actually also go so beautifully with the green earrings that I showed you. It's a very similar sort of pale green. And um, yeah, it's such a nice color for summer. So this is in this high neck and um, it's in a midi length and it's this stunning, um, I'm not sure what the fabric is, but it feels sort of linen blend. And it's, it's sort of like a creased effect to look. So I know some people probably won't like that, but I really love this. It's a lovely breathable thin material and it is a nice sort of figure hugging, but not tight. It just sort of glides over your figure and it's super flattering. And this one, I got in size extra small and it fits perfectly and this is 49.99. So I do think for the money, I think it fits really good. I would definitely say the quality is there. So I would recommend this one 100%. Next, I got another dress, which I also think would be lovely for a wedding guest, but also just on a holiday. This is so stunning. So this again is a midi dress. This is in this gorgeous square neckline. And it's in this really nice sort of uh, burnt orange color, which is another color that I absolutely love in the summer. I think this looks so nice with the tan and um, it fits again really well. This one, another thing that drew me to this is the back detail. So it's a little bit loose at the minute because I tried it on not long ago, but it's basically this tie detail at the back. So like the top half up, you tie it to fit. Um, the only thing I would say is it's when I tie it to fit, it fits really well, but the actual zip bit here is a little bit baggy, um, but it's not like majorly like it's, it's enough for me to get away with it. But yeah, I absolutely love this one. And again, I cannot recommend this one enough. And this one is a linen fabric as well. Um, this also has a slit in the side, so it adds a little bit of extra movement from the leg, which I love as well. And this one I got in a size extra small and it is $49.99. Again, I will say the quality is definitely there with this one. The fabric feels really lovely. And um, yeah, I'd say the fit is pretty much spot on. Next, I think this is my favorite dress. Um, I'm absolutely in love with this, but unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to keep it. But I'll explain why in a sec, but this dress is gorgeous. It's a maxi length and it's in this really lovely sort of burnt orangey, goldy, I don't even know what you'd call it. It sort of looks a bit like a petrol stain. Um, but it looks stunning on and then it is completely backless So it's got these two straps that go around there your arms and then the back um, Is like in the small of your waist and it fits really well as well Like there's no zip on this or anything So you just slip it on but it actually fits really good, which is surprising and this one I got in a size extra small and again, it's $49.99 This one isn't lined which is a little bit of a pet peeve but um, I do think that the fit is pretty good. The only issue for me is when I wear this on, you'll see in the cutaway, these straps sort of bring the neckline quite narrow on me. And I feel like the strap should be more sort of set to the side of my shoulders. I think that looks more flattering. And I think when it cuts your shoulders in half like that, it makes you look more broad, which is not something that I personally want. Um, so for that reason, I think I'm just gonna return it because I don't think I'll get the wear out of it. Part of me did think that maybe if I shortened the strap slightly on either side, it might solve that issue, but then I don't want to keep it and do that and then it not work. So that's um, something to bear in mind, but other than that, I absolutely love this dress. The length is perfect and yeah, it's just so gorgeous. And they also brought this out last month, I think, in silver and this sort of like white color and that was stunning as well but that sold out so quick and i think this one is gonna um be like that as well i think it's gonna sell out so if you like it definitely go and get it quick and then lastly from zara i got this asymmetric shoulder mini dress and this is in this stunning linen fabric and in this khaki color this one is really gorgeous, but again, this one is actually a little bit short on me, which is really unfortunate because I actually think this looks so stunning on. Um, 
but I think maybe if I got it in the next size up, that might solve the issue. So that's something I might try. This one also has this really nice sash detail that sort of like sits just behind your shoulder and like flows behind you, which is really flattering. Um, it has this like fringing as well at the bottom of the sash, which looks really cool. This would just be so stunning on holiday in the evening um, or out in this country in the summer, like for drinks with your friends. Um, and I also love the rouge detail on the side. I think that really adds to a dress and makes it look more expensive. And this one I got in a size extra small and again it is $49.99. Um, this one again isn't lined, um, which again is sort of like a shame because it's not see-through or anything, but you just think for that amount of money, I, I do think it should be lined. Um, but I, I do think that this dress looks stunning on. If you can get the size that fits you, it will be really gorgeous. So I think I might try this in the next size up. Um, but yeah, I do really love this dress as well. So that is everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. I am so in love with all the jewelry pieces that I got and also a lot of the dresses from Zara were absolute winners. As I said before, everything will be linked down below in the description box. You can shop everything from down there. And if you did want to head over to PD Paula and check out their jewelry, be sure to use my discount code, which I'll pop on screen again, which is OliviaB15 for 15% off. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.